So normal. How did you get discovered? This is an unusual story. <laughs> well, first, a producer, I met a producer in Barbados who was vacationing there because his wife is from there. So he was vacationing there one time, and my friend who knows him, she wanted me to meet with him. So in a nutshell, I went to his hotel room, I sang for him, and he was impressed. So he invited me out to his studio to do some recording, and we recorded for like a year back and forth. Then we finally put a demo together. We sent it to a few labels, and Def Jam happened to be the first label to call back. They were the most enthusiastic about everything. So we set up a meeting with Jay-Z, and I met with him, and he was very impressed by the audition. And he didn't let me leave until 3 in the morning after we signed the deal. Well, were you nervous meeting Jay? Was what? It? I was so, <laughs> like, I was literally shaking in the lobby, like, like this. Like, <laughs> it was horrible. So you, you, <laughs> must have, you must have a good way of... Jay-Z signing you a little while ago, you going into his office singing for him. Can you just describe that? experience and, and what happened? Mm -hmm. That was a very nerve-wracking experience for me, actually. It was really scary. I will never forget that day. Um, I met with Jay-Z, and before I met him, I was really nervous, like I was shaking. But he's such a cool guy. The atmosphere was really comfortable for me to audition in. And I auditioned, I sang the last time, Ben Houston's version of Father Love of You, right. and Punda Replay. And when you're singing the songs, he's just looking like this? Yes. Was it something like that? No, it's just it was that very chill or? and laid back and just looking yeah. at me like, just didn't move. He had really? no expression on his face. None. Do you like when that happens or would you rather have him like Actually, moving around and smiling it was, a bit? It was very, <laughs> that made me even more nervous because I was like, yeah, me, Rihanna, and that is Mr. Peter Berg. Baby, it's Rihanna. Join me as I take over Aku and make it re TV with a special presentation of my new album, Unapologetic, coming out Monday, November 19th. I bet you never seen bitches twerk on water. My bitches twerk on water. No basic zone. No basics. Hello guys, it's Rihanna and I just want to say thank you so much for all your love and your support. I can't wait to, for you guys to see my first film, Battleship, and I cannot wait to come to Taiwan. Oh, this is amazing. Um, first, congratulations to the follow nominees, um, Alicia Keys and Sade. I'm in very good company. Uh, I also want to thank the AMAs for making this possible for me, as well as my fans. Thank you, I love you. Thank you so much for your support. L.A. Reid, the whole of Def Jam, Rock Nation, all my crew. I love you guys, I love you. They're telling me to please wrap up now, so what's up? Thank you! <laughs> and we're reporting live from backstage in the Savage X Fenty. Show here with sweaty ass Jay Brown. <laughs> but we look, this is Dawn, the Dawn. Oh, what are you doing, Heart? What are you doing, Heart? He's tapping the heart? I don't got that. I don't have that heart. No. What are you doing with these hearts on his side? Enough hearts. Oh shit, you don't have so I can't do nothing with your hearts? I can't like press them back? Maybe the You can't always walk how bad you can. Coming. The most common type of product you can ever see is the prescribed for the medication. The medication will help to 